In this video, we'll look at how we can use SCP or secure copy that uses SSH to copy or transfer files and folders from a Windows PC to an Ubuntu uh, Linux machine. And also how to copy those files from the Linux machine to the PC. Now the first thing we'll need to do is to ensure that we have SSH installed and enabled on the Ubuntu machine. And uh, right here what you can do is we can check, uh, we can use systemctl status SSH. And you should see that it's active and running. Now if we don't have it installed, the command to install it, you want to do the up, sudo apt update to update your packages. Once you have your packages uh, updated, you go ahead and uh, run the command to install it. Now the command is uh, sudo app install ssh. And because I already have it installed, to do install it, it says ssh is already the newest version. Once you have that verified, you can go ahead and check your IP because you need the IP address to use on the uh, Windows PC device. You also need your username and password. So the username you have for this Linux machine and the password. Let's check the IP address. And this is the IP right here, 172.16.1.103. Now we have those two items. Uh, what we'll need to do is to determine which directory we want to copy the files to. So let me open another tab here. And I'm going to be putting those files here and the folder here that I'm going to copy from the Windows PC. Now uh, there's nothing here right now. Let's go under open PowerShell on the Windows device. This can be done on a Windows 10 or Windows 11. So this is PowerShell. And I already navigated to the folder that's it's got the files I'm going to transfer. So this is the folder right here. I have two, I have actually a file and then a folder. I have a folder called test folder two and a test document text uh, file. Before we do the transfer, we'll need to do a ping to that device. Let's go ahead and do a ping to check that we can reach that remote device, which was 172.16.1.103. And I can reach it via ping. So now I can run the SCP command. Now, like I said, we need the username and then we also need the uh, password. Let me see the files here. Uh, this is the file I'm going to transfer. And I'm going to put it here in this directory right here. Okay. So the command is SCP. Then you're going to follow it by the the file you look you're looking to transfer. So in our case it's in this current folder so I'll use dot then I'll use a backslash then I'll just put in this document test document and then you have to put the username username for the Ubuntu Linux device, add symbol, then the IP address, which was 172.16.1.103, colon, then the directory at the remote the directory at the remote device that you want that file copied to. So it's gonna be home slash eno slash desktop. Um, desktop uh, forward slash which is right here you can do pwd and this is the directory right here once you have all that you can just press enter and they should ask for the password okay password and it says 100 percent it has copied that file to the remote device we'll look at the remote device Look at this. 
and there we have that document copied. The next thing we want to do is to copy a folder or to transfer a folder. So it's going to be the same command, just one slight modification. Now I'll do the up arrow to bring up the command. And right here, right after SCP, you want to do dash R. And then you want to specify the direct, the then you want to specify the folder. So in this case, our folder is test folder two. And this one is just going to remain the same, the username for the remote device, the IP address, and then the folder where you want to put that folder. So press enter, put the password again. Now let's check the remote device. We'll do ls again. And there you have it. We have the folder copied. Now, what if you wanted to copy a file from your Linux device or from your Ubuntu device to the PC? We can do that using the same command. We just reverse the source and destination. Now let me create a file first here. I'll do touch you know txt. This is the file I'm gonna copy from this Ubuntu device to my Windows PC. Now I have now I have this text file. Let me open my uh, bring PowerShell. The command is gonna be the same, but we're gonna move this to the beginning. So it's going to be SCP. Now we'll be coming from this device. So let me go ahead and copy this. Um, and then you have to specify the file, which was Eno. It's under the desktop directory, Eno TXT. And now I'm going to copy this to this uh, folder right here where we are. I'm just going to put a dot to represent this current folder. Press enter. Again, I'm, I'm being prompted for password. And it's copied 100%, you know, dot txt. And if I do ls here, it has copied the file here, which wasn't there before. And that's it for this video. That's how you can copy files securely using SCP from your PC to Ubuntu Linux and from Ubuntu Linux to your PC. I hope this has been helpful. I'll see you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.